guys welcome back to this video today's video is going to be a reply to one of the comments that i got on my youtube channel regarding this video our uh, reel that i've made for tiktok and instagram and i decided to post it as a short on my youtube channel and someone asked me a question which i think is very important for us to address as interviews are currently going on welcome to my channel if you're joining me for the first time my name is delphine konda and i do make educational content so what is this question that i was asked one of my subscribers asked me hello delphine please help me understand this if i answer the question tell us about yourself question with the leadership examples how will i answer the leadership question should it be asked or they will not ask it since I've already talked about it. First of all, let me say that this is a very, very important question. So let us address it. The first things first, all of these videos are my personal opinion and I'm just helping you guys based on my own experiences. I haven't been a chivening scholar for over five years and I haven't worked with scholars um, after my graduation in 2016, um, 2017, year in, year out. These are my personal opinion and I know that Chivening is looking for leaders. So if they ask you a question about, tell us about yourself, this is just setting the stage for the interview. It's a really simple question to ease into the whole process. So what I am saying is, do not get personal. Think about your leadership journey. Think of yourself as a leader. You do not need to give all of your leadership examples because that means that you're going to be talking above one minute. And every time you're doing an interview and they're asking you, tell us about ourselves, and you're talking above one minute, frankly, you're already saying the things that may not be relevant. Emphasis on may not. The thing is, you're just coming, you're just easing into it. So I don't see what you will be saying for above 30 seconds to one minute and you're just talking for, for the very first question that they ask you. You should be able to be very clear about what you're saying. Bear in mind that Chivinin is looking for leaders. So whether they're asking you a networking question, a university course choice, post-career study plan, um, or post-study career plans whatever however you want to freeze it they are looking for the leader in you so if they ask you a question and you think about just think about brief aspects of your leadership journey that you could see in such a way that you don't necessarily need to exhaust all of your examples your two to three examples that you may have listed in your chivining ac okay the next thing is when you're talking of course look at the body language of those that are interviewing you look at their countenance are they immersed in what you're seeing are they invested in what you're saying? Are they paying attention? If you find out in my own time, when they asked me this question, I made a mistake. I was rambling and I noticed that they were not with me. And when I noticed, I kept on rambling as a way to try to fix what I was saying, which was making it worse. And God so merciful, one of the interviewers decided to stop me and ask a follow-up question, which is what helped me to redeem myself from not answering the first question properly. I always say that applicants should not get personal when they are asked this question. This is the reason why. Having worked with so many of you over the years since I got back from Chivinin, and I noticed that applicants get there and they forget the reason why they are. They feel that the interviewers are interested to know about the little mundane things about their lives for instance i know of an applicant who said that they loved watching netflix movie while that is an interesting aspect about your life but it is something that does not contribute in any way to the interview at that time because the applicant was definitely not going to study theater arts or movies or whatever for chivening 
they had a completely different track so how is you loving to watch netflix movies an interest an important not an interesting excuse me an important contribution to that interview at that time for that question so those are things that you need to pay attention for attention to if for instance i go for the interview now and they ask me to tell them about myself i would say something like i would use a personal approach frankly which is contrary to what i'm telling you but i'm going to use it because i have mastered over the years working with you all i've mastered a way to navigate that question in a way that will use the personal to highlight my um, trajectory as a leader my abilities as a leader to impact not only myself but my community for example tell us about yourself i will say something like um i'm saying this now offhand um my name is delphine kondam i was born in this and that year and raised in a small town called limbe which is um from one of the two english-speaking regions of cameroon i was raised by a single mother whose daily struggle as a petty trader to make ends meet and provide an education for me is the inspiration why i decided to go into community development work particularly to promote access to education for the girl child this is why i decided to start the organization called girls excel Girls Excel is a social impact organization that creates access to reproductive health education for adolescent girls and young women. Thanks to this passion that I have demonstrated over the years, I have been able to I give my quantitative and qualitative data. That way, I have introduced to you a personal approach that I was raised by a single mother we had our own challenges as a family but those challenges did not deter me they inspired me to become an advocate for girls education in my community as a result i did not only become inspired but i took action by starting or creating a platform that will accommodate the ambitions of adolescent girls and young women to pursue their own education and exploit their full potential in life this action has led to one two three number of adolescent girls and women becoming empowered in this or that domain i have done this you know as you give those kind of examples that's a personal approach but you need to use it if you know that you can make it work i have not even given half of my leadership journey i have not even given half of my examples that i can give in a chivening application so when you do it that way in like 30 seconds to one minute and you balance up yourself and wait for them to ask you the next question, then you still have so much that you can say if they ask you another question in the leadership track. Because even when they are asking you about a networking question, they are in essence asking you about a leadership question. Because they are asking you how you have been able to exploit your network to create impact. That is something that only a leader can do. So that's how you should approach that question. Think about it thoroughly because it will come. It will come in a different format, but it will come. They will ask you a leadership question. So think through it already. Assess, assess how important at that moment is that question. Is it just a question that they are br using to break the ice or is it like something that you should really focus on? Assess the room, look at the people you're talking to, make eye contact to see if they are on the same page with you. If they are following, then you can continue. If they are already bored, then you stop make sure that you round up and wait for the next opportunity 
to answer another question. Do not keep talking and rambling and go off script. If you are already invited for the interview, you are that good. They think you're that good. You just need to show them that you are. So don't, don't be rattled. So guys, that was it for this question. I hope that you did enjoy it. Let me know in the comment section if you have other questions that you would like me to reply to promptly. Until we meet again, guys, please do not forget to create some impacts.